Hi guys, welcome to Tech Tricks Tutorial. Today, we are going to talk about Shopify versus Wix e-commerce. It's a step-by-step -step guide to follow easily, and don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Now, let's dive right in. Now let's begin and let's start off with Shopify right here first. So Shopify is actually an e-commerce platform where you can sell digital and even physical goods. And you could also do drop shipping with Shopify. So now let us go right into the pricing so that you would know how much it costs to start up with Shopify. So basically, there's a three-day free trial that requires no credit card, basically. And for the first month, you would enjoy $1. So here are the three plans that we have. We have the basic, the Shopify, and the advanced. So for the basic, it costs $25 US dollars a month. For Shopify, it costs $65 US dollars a month. And the advanced costs $399. $99 a month so if you're still starting in the first few three months then you could start with basic and then you could also change your plan into Shopify or advance if you go to yearly you would actually be saving 25% of the monthly cost all right now let's go into the platform itself and let me show you how it looks like so basically all i need to do is i'm going to simply log into my account and here you will see my stores so i'm going to click on the store that i have right here and this is how the admin platform looks like so in here you could actually see um, your analytics and your sales now let me show you our online store here in Shopify. So this is how our online store section looks like. Basically, you will see the theme library and the different themes that you can actually make use. Okay. And so far, this is how our store looks like. This is just a mock-up store. So basically, it's not really as appealing as it seems to be. So, this is basically the website that your customers could go into and buy your items that you are selling in Shopify. Now, let's go back to our theme section. And in order for you to edit, you could click on the customize button in the theme section of your Shopify admin. So, right here in the left-hand panel, you could actually see your panel or bar. So we have our theme settings. You could change the color, typography, the logo, and whatnot. However, if you are good with coding and web code design, you could also use a web code in order for you to change your Shopify store design. And right here, you could add the codes, the layout, and template that you would want to have um, being added onto your Shopify account that easy and simple now let's move on to our wix website so wix does not only focus on e-commerce but rather um it also have different kinds like blogs if you want to start your own um you know own blog or a website itself just for yourself then you could actually do that but we're gonna focus on the e-commerce side of our Wix for today's video. So how do we create your e-commerce site? So here with Wix, you can sell everywhere using the Wix e-commerce. Okay, in order for you to create your store, you just need to input your email address. And then basically, let's try creating our store right here. So here are the different types of things that you need to know before you get started with your Wix um, store. So you need to determine your target audience, choose what to sell online, decide on your structure and the likes. So it actually gives you very good to know articles in order for you to get started on how you can design your Wix e-commerce platform. Okay, in order for you to actually get into 
your Wix e-commerce, you need to upgrade your plan and that actually costs. So there is no free trial as for our e-commerce. So here, let's go to our business and e-commerce plans. So with business VIP, we have $35 a month. With business unlimited, we have $25 and business basic, that's only for $17 a month. All right. There, you could actually accept online payments, grow your business, and get the full site. If you do want to have the business VIP, of course, then you're going to get the full site and unlimited benefits of your Wix platform. All right. If we try to compare the prices of Shopify and Wix, of course, Business Basic has a lower pricing as compared to the basic plan of Shopify. Okay. All right. You could also check out their enterprise plans if you are going to go for large scale businesses. So there you can see their um, partners and also the benefits of having an enterprise plan. But you would need to contact them for the price of that one. All right. Now, Wix also offer a web design course for those people who do not know much about web designing and are still starting up with their e-commerce platform or e-commerce website basically using Wix. So there. So can you can get those courses. Just go to Wix Learn Center and by then you would see in the left hand corner the digital marketing, business solutions, e-commerce and all those kinds of things that you can get to know. So here the e-commerce setting page is the place where you can customize your checkout and the likes. So there for your orders, you need to create an invoice. You can actually do it automatically. All right, you have the option. We also have our checkout policies right there. Um, the item price settings. Uh, you can also customize your checkout. You could also do that in Shopify as well, but basically and your order email notifications and the likes. So basically it's in your choice or within your power whether or not which to choose whether it's shopify or wix but as for me if you're still starting out then you could try out wix first since it has a cheaper cost and value and they also offer like um you know free uh, courses that you can get to know more about the platform itself but all in all, Shopify and Wix are two very strong e-commerce platforms that you can begin with. And that's about it for today's video. I hope that you find this tutorial helpful and thank you so much for watching.